Hey friends, welcome to Freedom in a Budget. My name is Kelly and my channel is all about living a great life unless I teach people how to live a better life within the constraints of a budget and how a budget can actually give you freedom. Hashtag my budget gives me freedom. And today I'm gonna to just share with you my April 2019 budget report card video. I go line by line of how I am spending our money, how much money we're bringing in, how it's allocated, and how we're able to hit our goals. We have some really big financial goals. Right now we're currently saving $100,000 for a down payment on our first home. And it's really exciting. I do have this budget template for you guys on my Etsy shop if you want it for yourself. It's currently on sale right now in honor of my birthday. It is my birthday month in April, I'm turning 30. And so the budget template is only $4 for this month. So the entire month of April, only $4 for the template. So I'll have that listed down below in the description box for you. All right, we're going to jump right in. As always, our incomes from our day job are blocked out. I work in compliance for a staffing company for medical staffing, and Jamie is a traveling lighting designer. Per diem, Jamie brought in so far $375 for his per diem for his work. Interest and cashback deals, this is for our sinking funds. We have our sinking funds in Capital One 360, which has a great interest rate. So that's from that. And then also any credit card deals or anything like that, then that goes into that. So far for the month, we've brought $50 in, but we expect about 160 total for the month. Side hustle, um, we have brought in so far $1,009.44, $111.75, so that was from affiliate marketing. I am absolutely loving affiliate marketing. It has been such a fun, fun project for me to do in combination with my YouTube and blog, and I have taken a course on it from Michelle with Making Sense of Sense. So I'll have that link down below for you guys if you are interested in taking the course. It was a game changer for me, not only in learning of ways to improve my affiliate marketing, but also the legal aspects of it because there is a lot of legal stuff that I didn't know that you can get in trouble with very easily. So it's super important to know all the legal stuff behind affiliate marketing. Meal prep for coworkers, $36. Etsy shop, $43.19. Jamie Animations, $485.20. He does animations for um, as a side hustle. I'm creating it like different logos and different things for people. Um, YouTube and Money Coaching, $96.80. Mystery Shopping, so far, $54.50. And then Jamie sold some equipment, and that was $182. So it's super fun seeing Jamie in this side hustle here. Our goal for the month is $2,000 and then anything that is in orange that is business income. So at the end of the month I like to add up all of the business income and so we can see what it is. Um, I still haven't gotten paid for YouTube yet, that'll be coming shortly so um, I think that's going to be about $600. But if you um, watch my budget report card at the end of the month, end of April, beginning of May, you'll see the actual number there. But I think it's gonna be around 600. And then I have some more marketing coming in and um, different stuff coming in. So these are not final numbers for the month. But so far, $1,009.44. So we're halfway to our goal. Um, sinking fund transfer, $50. We're gonna get to that in a little bit. So total income so far for the month is $7,455.57. Let's scroll down a little bit to our regular costs. Tithe is blocked out as always. Um, that is between us and um, us and God. Argentine missionary, $201. Leandro, the boy that we sponsor through Compassion International, $45. We haven't paid that yet. Rent, we did get a discount of, on our rent because we were having a leaking and mold problem um, from the AC unit upstairs that leaked and it cost some mold and ruined some shoes. So they gave us a $250 credit. So this month for rent, we paid $1,360 versus um, the normal $1610. Electric was a little bit under budget, $58.57 iPhone was the same 6622. That's for Jamie and I's iPhone for two lines. Internet, we haven't paid that yet. Weight Watchers, I haven't um, paid that actually in a couple months because you guys are using my link on a free Weight Watchers. But I'm actually thinking about leaving Weight Watchers and just using the iTrack Bytes. Um, Weight Watchers free sale is not really working for me right now and I've heard a lot of good things about reverting to old Weight Watchers, but that is for a different video. 
Massage self-care is one of my 2019 self-care goals and getting monthly massages, so $65 a month. Hulu, we haven't paid that yet. Robinhood investing. If you guys saw my video on Thursday, I actually did a video on Robinhood, which was so much fun and it was way outside my comfort zone, but it was a lot of fun to do for you guys and I learned so much about the app and how easy it is and I show you like how to break down Robinhood and how to um, buy some stocks and some ETFs. It was so easy and user friendly. So go check out that video from Thursday. Jamie subscriptions um, so far was 6092. So let's go take a look at that. That is this orange box. So he um, has just gotten some subscriptions of different things that he does with iTunes, HostGator, Google, Patreon, different things like that. All right, let's get into our other regular costs. Groceries, so far for the month, we have spent $109.27 for the month. Our grocery budget is $200, so we're a little over halfway there. Jamie eating out, he spent $110 even. Jamie per diem, $106.48. Kelly eating out, I have spent $60.62. Um, pocket money, um, just big lots, seven sixty two. Jamie pocket money, seventy dollars and fifty two cents. Gas, seventy nine thirty four. We already talked about subscriptions, and then miscellaneous expenses is five hundred one dollars and eleven cents. Let's see here how we are doing. So Jamie subscriptions, he is under budget so far by fifty nine dollars and eight cents. Groceries, $200 total budget, we're at $109.27, so we have $90.73 left for the month. Jamie eating out, he is $140 under budget so far. Jamie per diem, he is $268 under budget so far. Kelly eating out, I am $39 under budget. Kelly pocket money, I am 96, or I'm sorry, $92.74 under budget. Jamie pocket money, he is $154. 48 under budget. Gas, we are $70 under budget and miscellaneous expensive, we're at 501.11. All right, so debt so far, debt is at zero, we are debt free, and we just leave this in here to remember our, that we paid off $23,000 worth of debt. Sinking funds, my favorite part. Um, here's our six month emergency fund sitting at $25,000. We are looking to up that to a full year emergency fund but we're also saving for the house so we're gonna maybe bump this up after we get the house and we have used $50 so far for spontaneous giving for a co-worker and that was for a gift I don't remember what it was for but I remember it being a $50 gift for a co-worker okay let's see Jamie's car is sitting at and I fill off my sinking funds at the end of the month so right now if we did not pay any more bills which we do have some more bills left over but if we weren't we would have four thousand three hundred ten dollars left to spend and that would be going towards our sinking funds so we do have two more paychecks coming in as well as some more bills so we'll probably end the month probably around Mm, five or six thousand dollars left that's going to go towards our sinking funds but right now I'm just going to show you where we're at it's Jamie's car fund is at two thousand six hundred dollars and he is looking to buy a Tesla in the next couple of years so we're putting five hundred dollars a month away for that down payment fund is currently at thirty three thousand four hundred thirty nine dollars and forty seven cents and we're going to be saving about a hundred thousand dollars Kelly State Home Fund at $900. Christmas, $151.26. Spontaneous giving is currently at $145.02. Laptop fund is at $353. Car repair fund is at $364. Home repair and decor is at $124.81. Gifts is at $85. Vacation fund is at $2,656.18. We're currently saving for our Alaskan cruise. Medical is at $210.79. Car insurance is at $1,612.07. Renter's insurance is at $41. Phone repair upgrades is at $480. Jamie's desk and tech supply is at $7550. And YouTube taxes at $175. 
So that gives us a grand total of $68,413.10 in our sinking funds, which is awesome. And that is the budget, guys. So let me know how you're doing for the month of April. Is the month going well for you? Is it not going well? It is not too late to turn this month around. And let me know how you guys are doing. I would love to cheer you guys on, help you in any way that you can. I am here for you. Don't forget that I do have this in my Etsy shop, this budget template, and it is on sale right now for $4. All right, guys, let me know how you're doing. All right, I will talk to you later. Bye.